Anyone who's anyone in the world of social media has to visit this little street in the 12th arrondissement of Paris, if ever they find themselves in the French capital. There are already more than 36,000 photos with the hashtag Rue Crémieux on Instagram. Kelly and Tanya live an hour away from Paris. They're hoping to pimp up their Instagram feed. It's so colourful, so we're taking colour pictures. It's prettier, the pictures come out nicer. Is it pretty where you're from? No, not at all. There are just buildings, it's not pretty like Paris. But the local residents are sick of people taking pictures of their homes. Day in, day out, people just turn up and start snapping away. So, they've taken to hiding inside. The residents used to take their tables to eat outside, but not now. And I understand why. Everyone's here because of Instagram. Not to take a picture of the street, but because it's become fashionable to go to Rue Crémieux. Most of the locals refuse to talk about the subject in front of the camera. They say that each report just makes things worse. Journalists are no longer welcome here. It's annoying. We're sick of it. Why is he filming me? Enough already. I'll break your damn camera. Rappers and dancers make videos here. There are drunken stag parties. A local residents' association has put up a sign banning photos and videos. But it's all in vain so long as the police don't interfere. Tourists just keep coming. This photo was uploaded eight minutes ago. This one ten minutes ago. Another 25 minutes ago. The world of Instagram is about imitating. If something goes viral, people want to do the same thing. They want to have as many followers as possible. Amandio from Madeira doesn't need a guidebook. All the information is online. I saw a lot of uh, like famous posts in here, like uh, in the Instagram spot. I follow some, uh, some, uh, some uh, travelers uh, around the world. Um, you may say influencers, I think. <laughs> And uh, I, saw, I saw a lot of uh, pictures in here, so I was cu curious and I went to, to see. The locals have demanded barriers at the entrances at either end of the road. They would like to close them, at least at the weekend. No barriers yet. But some respite might, ironically, come from the world of advertising. The Rue Crémieux has become a mainstream money-making phenomenon, which could put the Instagrammers off. Here's an account with pictures of Rue Crémieux. If you click on the dress, you see the brand is Maha Outfits. And if you click again, you go to their account and see they're selling clothes. Rue Crémieux is already becoming less fashionable, because everyone knows it. So people are already looking for the next place. So the locals might be able to come out of their homes soon and get out their tables again. The Instagrammers, meanwhile, will surely have invaded another quiet idyllic street.